Greetings, my name is Edric Lockbus. I've been in Minnesota since 2003. Um, I arrived from Venezuela. I left Venezuela because of political instability, um, economic um, lack of possibilities, and because I was concerned about my personal safety. During that period that we weren't working, I was in a party at a friend's house. We were, and I'll never forget this, there were 17 people there, and there were 12 handguns over the table, which one of them was mine. I'm looking around, I'm like, okay, I'm in my mid-20s, I'm educated, I'm, I have bulletproof windows in my car, I carry a handgun, this is the future that I want. I don't know if I'll get killed when I leave my house, um, being hijacked or kidnapped is a regular thing, so I don't want that. Oh, and by the way, I was born in Boston. I'm an American citizen, do I really need to do this? Caracas, where I come from, is a six and a half, seven million people city. So, and then I went to Chicago, I lived in the Loop area, very big, very metropolitan. I expanded my job search to Minneapolis and I eventually got a job in Minneapolis Marketing Agency. I came for one year. And it's been quite a ride. It's been a very long year. It's been almost 13 years. And I woke up one day with a wife, two kids, a mortgage, and I guess I'm never leaving because my wife is from here. And this is a great place to live. Uh, it's a great community, very educated place, very safe, excellent place to raise a family. And actually, I love it. It's my adopted land. I've been here a, a, third, uh, a quarter of my life. So this is an incredible place. I've always been, I've been very fortunate in my life. I always thought about giving back. So through this part of helping the corporation reach minorities, I saw the ailments. Um, disparities in education, disparities in health care, um, not understanding how to navigate the systems. In, as an immigrant myself, I understand how difficult the U.S. systems are. I decided it was, let's, let's, help, with the com let's help the community. So today I, uh, I founded a company called Raices Media, which means Roots Media, and we have three different business areas. One business area is publications. We have two magazines called Hispanic Tiempo Magazine and Vida y Deportes. And these two magazines provide resources to the community. The other uh, part of the business is called uh, Diversity into Action, um, which is really the cornerstone of our business. Diversity into Action is a multicultural outreach organization. We do career fairs and job expos and resource events where we help minorities get jobs, we help minorities connect with employers, and we help minorities um, start their own businesses. We, by connecting them with the right associations, the people, who, and give them the right training, and give them the right tools. Third part of our stool is still the multicultural outreach for organizations called Hispano Connect, where we do marketing programs from companies to um, minority segments. Life has changed a lot when I, last me 20 years, 15, 12 years ago when I came, or whatever, and different. Dreams to the Futures continue to grow my business and continue to help others um, see their dreams. Um, raise my kids well, get them through school, make them be good people. And keep on enjoying life. Life is great. Gracias por ver el video. Y si eres extranjero como yo y tienes una historia que compartir, compártela. Es parte de nuestro legado y es parte del proceso educativo para todos entender a dónde venimos. Gracias.